Sizlere hoş geldiniz. Ee, uzun bir aradan sonra sizlerle tekrar bir arada olabilmekten ve dünyanın en lezzetli mutfaklarından birisi olan Bangladeş mutfağını bu kadar yakınımıza Ankara'ya getirebilmekten duyduğumuz mutluluğu ve heyecanı paylaşmak için bizlerle olduğunuz için çok teşekkür ederiz. Normalleşme sürecinin ilerleyişi ve özenle aldığımız Covid-19 önlemlerimizle ilgili e, birlikte değerli Banga Bandu'nun doğumunun 100. yılının kutlandığı Bangladeş Yemek Festivali'ne ev sahipliği yapmak için Ankara Hiltons'a ailesi olarak biz hazırız. E, Green House restoranımızın kapıları yarın akşamdan itibaren her gün 4 gece boyunca saat 19 ile 22.30 arasında bu muhteşem lezzetlerle sizleri bir araya getirmek için açık olacak. Herkesi bekliyoruz. Çok teşekkür ederim. Assalamu alaikum. For the fair press, the press briefing of this late afternoon. Uh, and Ambassador Masumanan of Bangladesh to Turkey. Welcoming all of you who took the time of, out of your busy schedule to come here at Hilton, Ankara. Uh, to attend this event. We are very grateful to the authority of Hilton Saab Ankara and Turkish Airways for helping us to organize this event, which we were planning to do actually from last year. But due to pandemic, we couldn't materialize it. And at the same time, I want to thank our two chefs who came from the Middle East to be specific from UE, United Arab Emirates. They are working in two different cities. One is Mr. Habib, and another one is Mr. Mamoun. They are my country citizen, Bengalis, coming from Bangladesh, and I thank them from the core of my heart for helping us. Uh, I am also thankful to the diplomatic missions of Turkey and Bangladesh, based in Abu Dhabi and Dubai, for helping us with their travel, mainly the visa. And you have already been told by the general manager of Hilton Sa Ankara that we are actually organizing this particular event in observance of the 100th birth anniversary of the father of the nation of Bangladesh, like your Kamal Atatürk, Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, our father of the nation, as well as the 50th anniversary, we call Golden Jubilee, of independence of my country, Bangladesh. So we are very, very happy to see all of you at the, on the first day of this celebration to be here. And I also thank, especially, the previous general manager of Hilton Saab, Ankara, Mr. Mark Shamahar. Uh, he encouraged me a lot. Many of you know that I was previously ambassador to Germany also for three years. So I'm, I know how to get along with good German you know, leaders and businessmen. So it was fantastic to have him here. And when I gave him, just after my arrival here last year, when I told him my idea, that let's have something together, he said, why not? Let's do a food festival and then followed by a mango festival. I said, okay, we'll do one by one. But you know, one year has gone already. So I thank Mr. Mark. You know, our main challenges for organizing this event has been the environment, the pandemic situation. I thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that now at least the situation at least for today is better so we could invite you and we'll be holding this program not only in uh, Ankara, thanks to you know the Hilton Authority, we'll be organizing it in Adana as well as in Mersin. You understand, we chose these uh, different spots because of their different you know, uh, atmosphere. And we want to reach out in future to other, you know, Hiltons as well. Uh, I want to say a few words about Bangabandhu as well. Uh, Bangabandhu, like Atatürk, was ahead of his time. We call him the greatest Bengali of all time. 
for thousand years. We have a number of other personalities in Bangladesh, but Bangabandhu was the person who helped us to get our independence at the sacrifice of three million lives in nine months in 1971, just 50 years back. So you can easily understand whenever we talk about Bangabandhu, like you become sentimental when you talk about Akatu, we also become, you know, we can't, you know, uh, what would I say? It is difficult to, you know, not be emotional. Because this is the gentleman who sacrificed almost all of his family just for Bangladesh and its independence and the emancipation of our people, the citizens of Bangladesh. Only his two daughters at the time of his death was outside the country, Sheikh Hasina, no, current Prime Minister, Honorable Prime Minister, and Sheikh Rehena, who lives in London. Otherwise, everyone was killed. You know, whenever there is an independence revolution, generally within a few years come counter-revolution. It happened in Asia, Africa, Latin America, Bangladesh was no exception. Unfortunately, we lost Bangladesh within the first three and a half years of our independence. Now, under the great leadership of Sheikh Hasina, we are doing economically very well. You know, we are the fastest growing economy, one of the fastest growing economy in the world. We are the second largest producer of ready-made garments after China. We are within the first train in leather production and in some frozen food and others, we are also within the first ten in the world. We are the maximum supplier of peacekeepers, UN peacekeepers all around the world. And you know, in South Asia, per capita economic growth of Bangladesh, this year is the highest. Plus, we have already graduated from LDC to developing stage. But when we started in 1971, we didn't have much. Uh, about food festivals, we are doing it from long time. In the beginning, we did it as part of other big food festivals. But nowadays, we are doing it uh, as individual Bangladesh food festivals. I did it myself when I was DCM. My DCM is sitting next to me. When I was in China, we did it in a big way in China with even some other exhibitions together. Then we did it in, after China, we did it individual. We did it in a big way in Germany, in rich culture and other places as well. Other embassies are there who are doing it. And now we are going to do it after one year's preparation, thanks to Hilton in Hilton Ankara. I also want to uh, add another thing after Bangabandhu that Bangladesh started from scratches, but you all know, besides just per capita economic growth or making ready-made garments and knitwear or textiles, we, are all, we have also sent satellite to the orbit. So you can easily understand, 50 years back, when we started from scratch, maybe we didn't even dream that Bangladesh will be able, within the first 50 years, to send satellite to the orbit. Hmm? So these things, to the space, I mean. So these things are fantastic. I thank the leadership of Honorable Prime Minister Sheikh Hassan and her cabinet. Now between Bangladesh and Turkey, some of you will want to know what we are doing. Uh, we have long historic tie with Turkey because our bond is in language. If you follow, you will see many words from Turkish language as well as from Farsi and Arabic are used in Bangla and in different languages of the subcontinent. Beside that, as Muslim majority country, OIC member, we are very close because both the countries have more than 80%, almost 90% Muslim population, Bangladesh has. You have more than that. And our cuisine, when you test the kebab, the biryani, the halua, not the baklava, but many other, you know, food items are the same and we enjoy it. Both of us like maybe we a little more spicy, a little less, but we love it. And currently we are having a lot of business cooperation, even despite pandemic. Business has gone up 
Last year it was 920 million. This year already it is 1.2 billion. And we are hoping at the end of the year when we will again you know, count it, it will become maybe 1.4 or 1.5. Our target is within the next two years, even despite all the challenges, to make it at least 2 billion, if not more. Uh, this is another thing I wanted to say. And in defense cooperation also, you all know, you read the newspaper and you are regularly observing other avenues of media. We are your fourth largest buyer, so this is there. We are very grateful to the government of Honorable President Erdogan for supporting the displaced Rohingya refugees who came across the border between Bangladesh and Myanmar in 2017 in a big number. There are 1.4 million now living inside Bangladesh. We are trying to multilaterally, through multilateral diplomacy as well as bilateral diplomacy, solve the problem. In all these aspects, we always get help from the Turkish government, Turkish people, NGO, media, even through OIC. You know, uh, when Gambia made a proposal to go to the International Court of Justice, you have seen Turkey supported us, not just financially, but at all international organizations. They are supporting the stand of Bangladesh to help the Rohingyas, as well as directly through sending doctors and reliefs and everything to the different camps within the border of Bangladesh. I now will finally touch on cultural diplomacy. This uh, food festivals and you know music and painting and poetry, mainly these are part of cultural diplomacy or in a greater sense public diplomacy. And there is a very big role of food festivals in promoting it very correctly. In Bangla, I will translate it into English, we always say that through food you can easily reach the heart of a person, which is otherwise quite difficult. That means if it is a tasty food, by feeding your friend or your guest, you can easily reach to his or her heart. There is a Bengali proverb, so we also want to reach the heart of the people of Turkey through our special kind of cuisine. And that's why we are holding this food festival for a few days in Ankara, followed by Adana and Mersin. And I'm looking forward one day that, uh, inshallah, we will be able to have a really high quality, one or two, to just to begin with, uh, Bengali restaurants in Ankara and Istanbul, not, and not to stop there, to, it will spread to Izmir, Konya and other places. We already have started having them in a big way, you know in Europe, especially in London. In London we have 13,000, not London, Britain, 13,000 restaurants. And if you check the online, you will see a couple of billion pounds sterling. They are these, you know, restaurants and they pay and it goes to the exchequer of Her Majesty the Queen. You know that because it is online. And similarly, in other European capitals, plus USA, Canada, Australia, there are many good, high-quality restaurants. I'm very much looking forward, because during my tenure in Germany as ambassador, or in Morocco as ambassador, we took the initiative, and now you have many restaurants in those countries where I served. So this is my final wish for today. And now I will request my uh, translator, Mr. Kamal Dwan, to give the gist of what I have told. Thank you very much for your patient hearing. Listen. Thank you. 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 Thank bu organizasyonun destekler için kendisine ve tüm gerçilik ve çalışan ekip arkadaşlarına teşekkür ederiz. E, bu hafta Ankara Eğitim'de olacak e, Bangladeş Yemekli haftamız. Önümüzdeki hafta Adana ve Mersin'de e, çarşamba, cuma, cumartesi günü akşamları otelimizin ana restoranında 
birbirinden, birbirinden farklı. Bangladeş devletlerini tefk edebilirsiniz. E, ayrıca bugün e, Dubai'den gelen e, şeflerimiz e, Habib ve Manon, bizim egzeklifimiz şefimizle beraber e, sizlere e, güzel bir yemek hazırladı. Birazdan hep beraber onu test edeceğiz. Bu yemeğimiz e, puşka e, çoktu. Geldiğiniz için çok çok teşekkür ediyoruz. Adem abi orada duracağım. Ne fotoğraf? Efe ben kendimi orada yormaz. Bu Anderson yazılık. We have today our state food, this is our like, traditional food. It's uh, all over in uh, Bangladesh, in the and in the state. We have today Muska, Muska and Chokkuri. This is made by, this is flat bread, flat bread, and we have some potato, egg, green chili, coriander, and, and onion, and we have tamara and sauce. So it's combined with this, as uh, you can see, this is our This is our short body. It's mixed with some uh, chickpeas, potatoes, and tamarind sauce, and some of the egg, green chili, coriander, and onion as well. Adem abi yutmak ister misin? Tamam sen de yapalım. Yürü 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 yürü. Nasıl? 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 Nası